Hi everyone, welcome to Apple Tech page. There are many iPhone users who have been reporting that they get the operation could not be completed when they were trying to connect their iPhone or iPad to Mac using QuickTime to record iPhone or iPad screen. In this video, I am going to show you how to fix this issue. Solution 1 is Check your USB cable. Make sure that your USB cable is not damaged and plug it well on both sides. If everything is correct, still you get this error, then try a new cable. Solution 2 is Force get QuickTime and reopen it. First, click on Apple menu and click Force quit QuickTime. Next, you will get Foursquit applications window. Here, you have to select QuickTime and click on Foursquit. Once done, reopen QuickTime and check it. Solution 3 is Restart your Mac. First, click on Apple menu and select Restart. Wait until your Mac restarts completely. Solution 4 is Reset all settings. When you try this method, all your customized settings will go back to default settings but no data or media will be deleted. Launch settings app on your iPhone or iPad. Next, find and tap on general. Then scroll down the screen and tap on reset. Select Reset all settings. Next, you will be asked to enter the passcode. Again, tap on Reset all settings to confirm this process. Solution 5 is Reset location and privacy. Go to Settings app. Now scroll down the screen and tap on General. Next, tap on Reset at bottom of the screen. Here, you have to select Reset Location and Privacy. Then enter the passcode of your device and again tap to confirm. Once you're done, connect your iPhone or iPad to Mac. When it connects, you will see a pop-up window on your iPhone that says Trust this computer. You just tap on trust. Solution 6 is disconnect all peripherals. If you have connected any peripherals to your Mac except your mouse and keyboard, disconnect them and try to screen record. Solution 7 is update your both Mac and iOS devices. Click Apple menu on your Mac. Next, click on System Preferences. Now click on Software Update. If Mac OS update is available, tap on Upgrade Now button. To update your iPhone or iPad, launch Settings app. Now find and tap on General. Next. Tap on Software Update. If update is available, tap on Download and Install. Solution 8 is Reset SMC. For Mac with non-removable battery. First, turn off your Mac. Next, connect your notebook to your power source. Now press and hold the Shift plus Ctrl plus Option keys and power button or touch ID at the same time. Hold it for 10 seconds and release these keys. Wait for a few seconds and finally turn on your Mac by pressing the power button. For Mac with removable battery. First, shut down your Mac. Next, unplug it from power source. Then remove the battery. Wait for a minute and put the battery back in. Then plug back into power source. Wait for 10 seconds. Now turn on your Mac. 
Thanks for watching. Do like, share and subscribe to Apple Tech page.